everyone, this is Alin Fila. I'm here now with Trans Family SM. from Frankfurt, had a delay for five hours. Oh no. So yeah, I had to stay a, a bit long in the Frankfurt airport. But thank God, all was good. I'm here on time, ready for tonight. Nice. Well, you know, we're always happy to have you back here in San Francisco. It's one of our pleasures to have you bring back the trans family together. Yeah, here in San Francisco, one of the biggest cities for trans music in the whole America. I would really? Say. Yeah. It's one off, yeah, for sure. That's nice to know. Um, tell us, over the last year, what is what has been one of the biggest changes for you guys as Ali? Well, actually, every every year is different because every year our profile is getting uh, more fans. The profile is getting bigger, so every year it's always changing with us. Like uh, I can always see it in the gigs, a lot of people coming in, the response and everything. It's, it's all, every year is different. Like the, the more we are in the scene, the more we do more music, the more we get more listeners and fans and, and so on. Nice. Tell us a little bit, what do you guys see in the future for All and Fila? What are you guys, some of your goals in the next coming year? Well, actually, our, our main goal is to, like, to uh, to make the people like who listen to us happy, satisfied, and to, and, uh, and to gain more people, more fans over the years to to spread our music all over the world. We want to make our our music like spread every place as much as possible, and we're trying to do that. And hopefully, we can, we can get that. And one of the other things that we really are pushing at the moment is our label and radio show, Future Sound DJ. This is like one of our things that major things that can take us to the Next maybe level. maybe yeah just like having a strong label behind you having a strong radio show it's a very good equation you know you can't go wrong with that i couldn't agree more yeah so uh what, tell us what was one of the most funniest moments you had while on tour over the last year Oof, a lot actually <laughs> the funniest uh, it's always great fun like hanging out with a lot of DJ friends like Sid Van Real, John Callahan, Giuseppe Ottaviani, Sean Tyus, all these guys, we always have so much fun. So Especially when you're all together at one place. Exactly, it go, always goes like a big mess. <laughs> a big mess. I can't say one story, maybe some of them won't, won't like to say the stories. Well, let's so go we, one that's we, not so bad. We, we, no, we'll keep it, keep it a bit of secret. <laughs> There's been a lot, a lot of change actually. Like I see a lot of DJs, like who got known for playing trance music, changing their style, playing other other styles. Maybe they don't they don't like the trance music anymore. Maybe they want to do it to uh, to become bigger or whatever. I I don't get it. But for for us as Ari and Fila, we want to stick to what we are doing. What we believe in, and when, whenever, like I feel that I don't feel this music anymore, I'll stop. I'm not gonna change my style just to adapt to the scene. But I think like trance music is very powerful. It's still like a lot of people say like trance is dying and blah blah blah. No, it's on the rise again. Uh, it's, it's it's rising all the time. It's it's very powerful, and I see it everywhere. To be honest. <laughs> of course, it's nice. everywhere. Um, if you were to choose one thing that you could go over the next year, what event would it be? 
event. Well, um, next year we're planning, actually, we're planning, uh, started planning the FSOE 300 party because this year we had a huge success with FSOE 250. It was a great success and uh, actually, like the whole night, FSOE 250 was trending topic on I Twitter remember. the whole night. And I was like, I was surprised because I didn't accept, uh, expect that. You thought it'd be only a side. <laughs> yeah, but I was like, wow, that's a lot of listeners are listening to us and uh, like writing all the time on Twitter. So I was really happy. So now a lot of people started asking about like, why don't you bring FSV 300 to our place, to our country? So we are planning to spread it next year to more uh, countries, more continents, and uh, see what we're gonna do. So we're gonna have like a, a theme show and we're gonna spread it with FSV 300. Actually, me and Ali, we are very close friends. We are, we've been friends since kindergarten. You know? Kindergarten? Yeah, we've been in the same kindergarten, same school, and we've been always like best friends, so that's how we met, actually. That's how you met? And yeah. How'd you guys start, decide to start making music? Well, me and Ali, we always love music, anyways. So we, okay. we said, like, we started music for fun, completely for fun. We never expected that we could reach what we have right now because we just did it for the fun of it and we love the music and we didn't have any expectations to be honest so that's how it went actually who is one of your biggest idols as you guys were getting into them just into it's the always, music? It, it always been Paul Van Dyke Paul Van Dyke yeah he's a big great inspiration to many of us and yeah exactly. well thank you again for coming we look forward to your set thank tonight you so much. rip the roof off and for sure. we'll see you back I will in San do that. sure man thank you so much Thank you.